<laughs> you know, um, just reading this Psalm 78, oops, mm -hmm. uh, verse 40, how oft did they provoke him in the wilderness? Yes. Grieve him in the desert. Yea, they turned back and tempted God oh, and limited the Holy One of Israel. <laughs> they remembered not his hand. <laughs> nor the day when he delivered them from their enemy, how he had wrought his signs in Egypt and his wonders in the field of Zoan, and had turned the rivers into blood in the floods yeah, that they could not drink. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. They had a polluted water supply. Yes. <laughs> That's always a big problem, really. Yeah. <laughs> It'd be terrible if we had a polluted water supply. Mm -hmm. You know, um, just so you understand, mm -hmm. uh, plugging into an outlet, yes, a piece of metal that's not magnetized, yes, and uh, pulling from the vehicle a piece of metal that is magnetized, yes, it causes the same effect of wanting to discharge the, the electrical magnetism of the actual battery, yep, goes right into the grid. Now, I have a little wireless device on top of the vehicle that communicates with any of the electric companies, yep. Why don't you get me the cost of electricity in this nation, every nation of the world? Yes. See, I have a steam generator. Mm -hmm. I have a wobbler. It's a small one. It, it gets the electric motor going. Yes. And for those that are concerned about, well, what are you going to do with the electricity that doesn't charge the battery? Mm -hmm. There's an actual electric motor that is run from the electricity of the uh, 10 different miniaturized dam motors. Yep. Now, I know um, this uh, pontonic that I designed, it actually runs on an electric uh, electric motor. <clears throat> now, you're going four miles. <clears throat> you're at the 220, and that little electric motor is just uh, moving right along. <clears throat> and you say, well, if I discharge it into the ground, then it will be part of the, the ground. Yeah. <clears throat> if I discharge it into the air so that it just releases unnecessary amounts of electricity. Yes. It become part of the atmosphere. <laughs> In fact, when you think of the pollution effect of the emissions of a, an automobile that is not a um, combustion engine, yes, and the amount of pollution involved in discharging any unnecessary amounts of um, electricity that the little motor generates, that the plug uh, regulates, ah! could be that we'd have too much electricity in the atmosphere if we had approximately 100 million cars using this type of technology. It caused lightning, wouldn't it? Yeah, thunder. <laughs> you know, if I was to ask myself how to remove the actual pollutants of the air, no, <laughs> because I have. I've asked myself that question. It'd be a type of uh, what's it called? This uh, the municipal water supply that uses ozonation. Yes. If you were to increase the amount of ozone, yes, as just the byproduct of the electricity generated that happens to charge the battery, depending upon the number of miles that you would ride it. Does ozone have the effect of cleaning the air? I'll give you an example. Shut, shut, now! 